What's up, family? This is my first time ever listening to Bob Seger roll me away. As always, family, I like to break down the lyricism, understand a viable message, and see how we can utilize that value to apply it to our lives to continue to be great individuals. Before we get into the video, family, give this video a big thumbs up. It helps crush that YouTube algorithm. It's totally free. So with no further ado, family, let's get straight into the video. Took a look down a westbound road, right away I made my choice. Headed out to my big two-wheeler, I was tired of my own boy. Hmm, that's some soul there. Took a beat on the northern plains and just rolled that power on. Twelve hours out of Mackinac City, stopped in a bar to have a brew. Man, travel. Come on now. Met a girl, we had a few drinks, and I told her what I decided to do. What you decided to do, brother? Come on, tell her. She looked out the window a long, long moment, then she looked into my eyes. Okay. She didn't have to say a thing. I said, roll me away tonight. Hey. Hmm. Let's continue. I do have lost. I feel double crossed. Now I'm sick of what's wrong and what's right. Mm. We never even said a word. We just walked out and got on that bank. And we rolled. Okay, family, I feel like the viable message that lies here is sometimes you just got to get away. You feel what I'm saying? You ever know that? You ever had that mood where it's just a smooth, cool summer night? It feel good. You just riding around in your whip, windows down with some good music on a night where it's just cool, calm, and collective, and you just riding. And you know how when you're on your way home, this is another example, and you don't want to go home right away. You got your favorite song playing, and you just... Delaying in your way to get home, turning around roads you don't even know, just riding down the road, just enjoying the peace and solitude. And I feel like sometimes, I feel like the message of the song is sometimes you just got to get away from our frantic lives and feel free, you know, and um, feel free and just being able to feel your emotions and feel through them, not let it lead you to any irrational behavior or decisions, but just to feel them, process them, understand, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like that's what Seger is talking about on his bike and escaping. And he found a girl who understood the feeling and wanted to share it, you know, but all good things must come to an end, right? Let's continue. Diss my guy like that. If you gonna commit to that thing of being on the road, then be on the road. And I feel like you know he found a girl that understood. Like I said, all things, uh, good things must come to an end. So she lost the lust. She lost. She lost the lust for freedom, and escape, and wanted to go home. And sometimes we do that. You know, we get a little bit scared, and we go back to what's comfortable, right? And I feel like the viable message is through adversity, or through adversity. And through times of discomfort, we tend to learn and gain wisdom, right? And it just shows, like, the scene of the young lady heading back home shows it has so much significance. Talking about the independence, pride, you know, the balls of a loner. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? A person who knows where he stands in life, loves his freedom, 
and won't let anything or anybody stand in his way, right? And to know where you go, to know where you're trying to go, you got to know where you're going to get where you're going. To know what you want, you got to go after what you want, and you got to know what you want, right? And um, and just like down every road, there's always one more city, as Meryl, Mer, Merrily Haggard said once said and sang about. And um, he said, I'm on a road, on a highway is my home. And this is a great song. You know, it's an amazing song and just encapsulating the freedom and understanding what freedom also responsibility um, has to take place. And it's nothing like understanding that when you're on the road alone, you're not purposely being separated from others. But you're on a destination on that narrow road that everybody's not meant to go down, right? And you're being separated for a reason in regards of in solitude, we tend to learn more about ourselves to be great so we then can bring value to others. Just as Bob Seger obviously had a moment like this to bring this valuable song to our lives, to apply it to our lives. So a lot of times we may think separation is bad, but really separation is preparing us for greatness. And I feel like that's what lies and what we can apply to our lives. And understanding everybody won't go where we're going, and that's okay. But to understand the freedom of being able to go in a direction, especially knowing where you stand in life, means everything. song man amazing song um just a desire to be free and a great feeling of infinite possibility is a beautiful thing and i feel like also the viable message is a lot of times family we get so comfortable being used to what we know and then we get scared of the discomfort of what we don't know but then we limit ourselves because there's infinite possibility of being great if you just not limit yourself and understanding there's so much out there to discover only than what you know. And a lot of times some people get comfortable in what they know instead of getting out of their comfort zone and holding themselves accountable to open their mind to then embrace wisdom for what they do not know. And I feel like that's what this song encapsulates. Comment down below you guys' perspective, insights, and thoughts. Amazing song. As we roll away with an amazing song, with a positive vibe to it, very uplifting and encouraging all in once. Let that love supersede the hate family. Spread that peace, love, and positivity. Until next time.
Peace.